These memories. wingless cookies. to see you outside. Cool! Caramel stew cookie! Cool! My favorite employee! The weather today is too nice for accidents. I hope all is well in our fine town, Square. Mm -hmm. Yes, Mayor Cookie Beans. Nothing to report, sir. Just another sunny morning. Cool! I just love me a good nothing to report. A good job, Caramel Shoe Cookie! It's all thanks to the years of your tireless work, Mayor Cuckoo Beans. Please, know that it's truly an honor to work in such a beloved place steeped in rich history, sir. <laughs> I'd like to say that we wouldn't have a town square without all the visitors. 
And that's precisely why we should pay close attention to each and every one of their needs. Yes, Mayor Cuckoo Beans. I shall do my best to make each visitor pleased with our town square, because I love it so much. Oh, sir, have you heard about the Sugarcoat Cookies' latest collection? Ah, a new collection, you say? About time. I'll have you know, I'm in the market for a new top hat and shoes. <laughs> with your permission, sir, I should go and check the petition board. is full of dreams. The wizards. I wonder where they went.
student means wanting to learn. I wonder where my birthplace is. Not angry. All life will fade eventually. of the stars! Let's start Charge. the parade. Shatter! The wrath of the stars! Out of my way! Let's start the parade. Shatter! Charge! The wrath of the stars! Let's start the parade. Let's start Shatter. the parade. For the stars. If the Guardian falters, no one would be safe. Do not be afraid.
I simply carry out my mission. I wish you happy dreams. Shall we write our memories in the stars? Let's start the parade. Light protect me! Shine! Four balls! 
The parade. This means a failure. Shatter. We shall witness the might of the seas. Why? Out of my way! You cannot pass! Pay close attention! Shut Shut darkness the be gone! You must oh. finish this! You won't pass! The wrath of the stars! Darkness be gone! This is my end. For the stars. Do you recognize this shield? I will not assault her! Such is my fate! Shut out of my way! Stars. We shall prevail! What's up? Another ingredient! The wrath of the, the stars! A victory 
before the stars. The merry-go-round awaits. Out of my way! Let's start Rock the parade. The stars! Crumbs shall return to space. Dreams. Out of my way! For peace and justice! Shatter. Let's start the parade. Shatter! My God! Remember who defeated you in battle! <laughs> You will regret this. Out of my way! Charge! More than me! I will not Let's falter! You must finish this! The rock of the stars! Let's start the parade! We shall prevail! Out of my way! You won't get away with this! Let's the start stars. the parade. We shall prevail. Out of my way. Rock Let's the start stars. the parade. My dream of victory came true. This time, I will take the cookie side. Out of my way! Did you watch me? Do you wish to be frozen? I will not falter! Let's start the parade. Bend in the stars! Did you watch me? Singing of our victory. Out of my way! Practice him all! Shatter! We we shall shall this this is the might of the you sea! Must you must this finish this! This was a mess. Crumbs shall return to space.
Fight if you bear conviction. Out of my way! You ordered me! Blessing! You must finish this! <laughs> What a beautiful night. Don't you dare break the cookie's dreams. Out of my way! You must finish this! I can't wait like this! this. My power betrayed me. I'll invite you to Cookie Land. Let's start the parade. Shut out of my way! We shall prevail. Let's start the parade. Did you watch me?
Gott. I do have other matters to attend to. for the tip, kiddo!
we shall let's let's start start the parade. Let's start the parade. I'm sorry. Let's start the parade. Money. Let's start the parade. Another ingredient. Let's start the parade. Another ingredient. Let's start the parade. Sure. Another ingredient. 
For the king! Let's start the parade. Open up our For the king! Let's start the parade. Another ingredient! Charge! For the king! Here I come! Light, Light protect me! Here I come! Battle order! Shower! Here we For go. peace we and justice! Witness the might of the seas! For Here peace and just witness the might of the seas! Out of my way! Huh? Here comes a Time masterpiece! Out of my way! Here comes huh? a masterpiece! Time for some digging! Give me a I beat. cannot Let's hold go. back! Let's Give me go. I cannot hold back! back. Let's go! Sure! Another ingredient! Let's start the parade. Another ingredient! Let's start the parade. Let's celebrate our victory! Let's start the parade. Yes, I'll get money. Another Let's ingredient. Let's start the parade. Yes, charge money for the king. Let's start Another the parade. Another ingredient. Yes, I'll get money. Let's start the parade. Another for ingredient. The king. Yes, charge get money. Let's yes. start the parade. Another ingredient! Charge! Yes. Let's I'll start the another parade. Another ingredient! For the king! Let's yes. start the parade. I'll another Charge. ingredient! For the king! Let's start yes. the parade. Another money. ingredient! Charge! Let's start the For parade. For the king! Yes. I'll get money! Let's yes. start the parade. Sure. Another Let's ingredient. Let's start yes. the parade. Another for ingredient. The sure. For the king. Let's yes. start the Another parade. Another ingredient. For the king. Let's yes. start the parade. Another ingredient. Let's I'll start the parade. Another ingredient. The Let's start money. the parade. Another ingredient. Here I come. Shadow. Light oh, protect oh, me. Oh, Here I come. Shadow. Here I come. spicy. Your forces are formidable.
You dare approach me. His Majesty is calling! Let's ride! I'll always be there to protect you. I, I never would have thought. Not only am I a faithful knight of His Majesty Elder Fairy, I am also a guardian of the Hall of White Lily Cookie. White Lily Cookie has a hall named after her? Of course! White Lily Cookie is a hero to the Fairy Kingdom. And if you're friends of White Lily Cookie, you're friends of the Kingdom. I apologize for my behavior earlier. Hmm. White Lily Cookie seems really important to the Fairy Cookies. They even think of her as a hero. I wonder what happened back then. I'll tell you everything once we get to the Kingdom. Out of my way! We shall Let's start the parade. Out of my way! We shall prevail. This is it. Uh, what is it? I can't see anything. The gate only shows itself and opens to fairies. <gasps> when did you come back? <laughs> you thought I'd miss a chance to enter the Fairy Kingdom? Stand back just for a moment. I will open the gate. <sighs> Remember who defeated you in battle! <laughs> The gate appeared out of nowhere? Whoa! Ay, my hat! I've never seen anything quite like it! Say, is it special fairy magic? <laughs> oh, Green Wanderer. Although you lack a pair of wings, like a fairy, your floral scent sings. Savior of our kind and eternal friend, open your eyes to see silver once again, for your journey has yet to end. Oh, I remember this scent. White lilies. It's so sparkly and beautiful. Whoa. So this is the Fairy Kingdom! <laughs> Where do I go first? Ah! There! <gasps> oh no! Please, no more spores! The fairies... They're singing a song for White Lily Cookie. If it wasn't for White Lily Cookie, the Fairy Kingdom would not have been able to prevent the Great Calamity. Hearing His Majesty describe how the arrival of the Great Calamity would mean great danger for the entire desert world, White Lily Cookie stepped up to help us without a hint of hesitation. Using every bit of her strength, she stopped the unthinkable. I had heard of ancient heroes beyond Beast Yeast who possessed the power of light, but I'd yet to come across it myself. 
It was the first time I saw a cookie whose power could rival the strength of His Majesty Elder Fairy. And although White Lily Cookie has fallen into an eternal sleep, it is said her soul is still fighting to protect the world of cookies. I guess the Shard of the Light of Freedom didn't disappear because White Lily Cookie's soul is still out there. What do you mean? White Lily Cookie's soul is Dark Enchantress Cookie's soul. Then does that mean Dark Enchantress Cookie is tricking the fairies? To prevent the Great Calamity. This way. I'm so happy I could help you reunite with your friend. The parade. Out of my Wrath way! Of the stars! Tis cold and silent at last. Stars. Let's start the parade. Out of my the way! Wrath of the stars! <gasps> Is it really a White Lily Cookie? It could be a trap set up by Dark Enchantress Cookie. I'm not going to fall for it this time. White Lily Cookie needs your help. She must wake up. Pure Vanilla Cookie. So that she may hear my voice once more. Your vanilla cookie. Oh, the voice. It's calling out to me again. It brought me all the way here to find you. Pure vanilla cookie. Do you think it's another one of Dark Enchantress Cookie's traps? Even if Dark Enchantress Cookie defeats all the four ancient heroes and seizes their soul gems, the one thing she can never possess is the light of freedom. For it could only shine for White Lily Cookie and her alone. And yet, she willingly chose to become another cookie. The shards of the light of freedom that we encountered in the forests of Beast Yeast, and the light that remains within White Lily Cookie slumbering here, they are remnants of White Lily Cookie that Dark Enchantress Cookie can never steal. I'm sure of it. But how? What keeps these fragments from disappearing? What could have happened to White Lily Cookie? <sighs> Silver Bell Cookie, I hear you've let Outlanders into our kingdom. Oh, Mercurial Knight Cookie. These cookies are friends of White Lily Cookie. His Majesty orders you to bring these outsider cookies before him. His Majesty wants to see us? Elder Fairy. This should answer a lot of our questions. White Lily Cookie's past, and this great calamity. Lead the way. Follow me. My dream of victory came true. Let's start the parade. Out of my the way! Wrath of the stars! We shall be You may step forth. Not gonna lie, I'm kinda nervous. So, it is you. Those who claim to be White Lily Cookie's allies. I mean, kind of. Yeah, it's all a bit complicated. I see cookies who bear the fate of the desert world on their shoulders before me. A cookie who took control of his own fate with his bravery. 
Oh, th 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 that's me? Is he talking about me? A warm-hearted cookie who always puts her friends first. <laughs> A cookie of short stature, yet wise beyond his size. Did he really have to point that out? And an ancient hero. A cookie of light who protects the balance of this world. Your Majesty, allow me to introduce us. This is Ginger Brave, Strawberry Cookie, Wizard Cookie. I am Pure Vanilla Cookie. We come from the land of Crispia. We are here in our search of a cookie who is threatening the peace of the cookie world. A cookie by the name of... Dark Enchantress Cookie. How did you know? <sighs> Since ancient times, I have protected this silver tree at the Order of the Witches. Throughout the ages, there have always been cookies who coveted the dark power it seals. None have succeeded to this day. Seeing to that is one of my many duties. I think there's a slight misunderstanding. Say, do you realize that White Lily Cookie sleeping over there and Dark Enchantress Cookie are the same? Yes, I am perfectly aware. The dough of White Lily Cookie that rests here in the Fairy Kingdom is the part of her that did not transform into Dark Enchantress Cookie. Can you tell us what happened to White Lily Cookie? In days gone by, White Lily Cookie departed on a dangerous adventure to unveil the truth behind the creation of Cookie Kind. Her path led her here, to the Fairy Kingdom. No matter how many times I warned her of the perils ahead, she refused to give up her mission. Instead, I made sure she carried a piece of moonstone with her wherever she goes, so that she may travel back here through the paths of the other realm. A piece of moonstone? But the moonstone is... Yes, it is forbidden dark moon magic, practiced by the witches only. The moonstone leads to the other realm known by the name Dark Side of the Moon. Is it the same Moonstone as the one in the Blueberry Magic Academy? Yes. White Lily Cookie used it to open gates to other dimensions during her days as a student. White Lily Cookie must have used the piece of the Moonstone to escape something terrible. Beyond that, her fate remains unknown to me. Not long after she left the Fairy Kingdom, the evil, dark Enchantress Cookie was born, and White Lily Cookie's empty husk of a doe was brought here via the Moonstone. Then it means... White Lily Cookie didn't transform into Dark Enchantress Cookie, but instead split in two. It would seem so. However, mere whispers of White Lily Cookie's soul remain intact. And scattered across the world as light of freedom. Your Majesty, you said that White Lily Cookie helped the Fairy Kingdom by preventing the Great Calamity back then. How exactly did she manage to do that? It is related to the power that is sealed by the Silver Tree, the power that Dark Enchantress Cookie is after. I suppose it is easier to simply show you. The stars are singing of our victory. The Sugar Swan is somewhere among those stars. stars are dancing tonight. All life will fade. I think of Cookie Land whenever I eat sweets. Out of my way! 
We shall shine the stars. Let's start the parade. Out of my way! Of the stars. We shall Shine. prevail. Oh, almighty silver, watch over us from above. And protect the peace and balance of this world of chaos. Oh, sheltering light, shine upon us. As your silver buds bloom, sealing the great shadow in the deepest depths. Are you aware of where your power comes from and how it is being used? Pure vanilla cookie? What are you saying? The power of virtue, purified by the witches themselves. The soul jam that you harness. You are not the first to wield that power. The same goes for the other ancient heroes. What? The ancient heroes are not the true owners of their soul jam? Well, then, who is? The story begins when this very silver tree was only a small sapling, when the world of desserts was at its infancy. The witches baked five cookies to help them in their creation of the world. Harness the radiance bestowed upon you for the betterment of this world. And the five cookies, imbued with absolute powers, walked earthbred as almighty envoys of the great creators. Knowledge, volition, happiness, change, and solidarity. The desert world bound by these five virtues was nothing short of paradise. So those five cookies were the original owners of the Soul Jam? Huh. Those five virtues are different from those of the Soul Jams. Alas, the perfect age was short-lived. Absolute power begets nothing but arrogance. It inevitably corrupts its wielder, bringing them to the most tragic of ends. A fate even the witches were unable to foresee. One by one, the five, once regarded as saviors of the cookie world, gradually turned to darkness. And thus, the five virtues, too, became distorted, twisted, reduced to deceit, apathy, sloth, destruction, and silence. Deceit, apathy, sloth, destruction, and silence. Ugh, that sounds really scary. Now known as the Five Beasts, the Apostles of Evil began their dark crusade. And forth they brought great destruction and suffering. The witches could not bear to see what fate had befallen their creations. They punished the beasts by sealing them away deep within this land and planted the seed of the silver tree to ensure their evil power never sees the light of day again. From then on, this land where the beasts were put to sleep was called Beast Yeast. The witches then gathered the last vestiges of power bestowed upon the beasts, untouched by their corruption. They further cleansed Soul Jam was created. The purest soul jam was meant to be earned by cookies who had proven themselves worthy. One of them is the light of truth that you received at the end of your long, arduous journey down the pilgrim's path. Before, both truth and deceit existed within the light of knowledge. Cleansing and purifying it created the soul jam that you wield today. This means the power of deceit is now... Yes, it remains sealed somewhere in beast yeast. And yet, your light of truth serves another purpose, which is to balance the scales of good and evil to ensure the beasts stay confined. The tree has five main branches. Seems like they represent the soul jam of each ancient hero. They're so shiny. But one of them looks 
dimmer than the other. One by one, four of the soul jams regained their strength. But for a long time, all of these branches were close to wilting. After the Dark Flower War, when all the soul jams have been shattered into pieces and scattered all across the world. During that long period of imbalance, the five beasts saw it as an opportunity to regain their strength. Huh? They recovered in such a short time? As the Guardian, I channeled all my power to keep the seal intact. But my strength alone was not enough, and the beasts have already grown much too strong. Now, this great evil lies hidden somewhere in beast yeast, ready to strike at any moment. Is there a way to prevent the beasts from escaping? Our last hope is to bring back the fifth ancient hero, White Lily Cookie, and her Light of Freedom. If we are able to do so, we just might be able to repress the evil forces sealed here in Beast Yeast. Is that really possible? Although the Light of Freedom may be scattered across Beast Yeast, White Lily Cookie's branch on the Silver Tree still shines brightly as ever. Not all may be lost. Perhaps there is still a way to gather the Light of Freedom and restore it to its full glory. But as of now... So we can revive White Lily Cookie by gathering all the shards of the Light of Freedom? I can hear it. The voice of the Light of Freedom speaks to me. Really? Is that really true? Then there is hope for us still. There is no time to waste. The beasts may yet escape and bring the great calamity upon us. And Dark Enchantress Cookie, whom you have been chasing endlessly, will not let such an opportunity pass. Pure Vanilla Cookie, you must gather the shards. White Lily Cookie's Light of Freedom. The last hope Dark Enchantress Cookie has yet to corrupt. Tis cold and silent. Always this hot? Did I startle you? My wings don't make a sound.
just a minute. I dreamed a happy dream. You cannot hunt dragons if you are afraid of them. Stand back. I'll take care of that. Just keep getting better, huh? As if Dark Enchantress Cookie wasn't enough, now we have to deal with these beasts, too! Why are there so many evil cookies? I knew she planned to burn the world to the ground, and yet... I never expected Dark Enchantress Cookie to covet the power of such... great evil. And to think that the original holders of the Soul Gem tried to use their power to destroy our world! What if Dark Enchantress Cookie manages to get her hands on the beast's strength? Oh, it's too scary just to think about it. We must prevent that from happening, no matter what. But if the beasts are the original holders of the Soul Jam, doesn't that mean that they are much more powerful than even the ancient heroes? D d do you think so? If the beasts break free from their seal, will that mean the end of the world as we know it? Firstly, let us all calm down and think about what to do next. We must collect all the shards of the Light of Freedom here in Beast Yeast, 
so that White Lily Cookie doesn't lose her strength. When we found that shard in the forest, it held some of White Lily Cookie's memories. As long as we follow the traces she left here in the Fairy Kingdom, we will be able to collect all the shards. But are shards of the Light of Freedom really all that's needed to wake up White Lily Cookie? And even if we are truly able to wake her, there is no guarantee she won't transform into Dark Enchantress Cookie. Out of my way! We shall Rock, prevail! The stars. Let's start the parade. Out of my Rock way! of the stars! Shatter. We shall prevail! Have you seen the true power of ice? What is this place? Shh, Ginger Brave! You don't want to disturb this somber atmosphere. There are so many cookie statues. Oh? Come to think of it, they look like the knights we met earlier. Knights graced with the silver blessing all grow to look one and the same. <laughs> A living statue! I apologize. My wings allow me to travel without making a sound. Are you one of the blessed knights? Indeed. Blessed by the silver tree and sworn to protect the guardian of the seal. I cast aside my flavor and scent. Now, only a silver knight remains. May I ask what kind of cookie you were before? A pointless question. This place is a memorial for the knights who fell back when the fairy kingdom came close to witnessing the great calamity. The day when White Lily Cookie saved the fairy kingdom? Yes. With the help of that one cookie, we managed to prevent disaster. But not without great loss. It must have been a huge battle. Oh. The fate of the Silver Tree determines the fate of the world. It is at the center of peace as we know it. His Majesty speaks of another great battle upon us soon. As I walk these halls, I once again remind myself of the oath I took. To devote my dough and soul to the protection for it is the only way that the sacrifice of these knights will not be out of my way we shall the stars let's start the parade out of the my way of the stars huh. the butterflies have come to congratulate me